Oh, hey. <laughs> Hi, guys. I know that, as you can see, the title down below, I haven't done it in this in this five months, actually. And, yes, finally, all our shows from the CW is coming back, like The Flash, Arrow, iZombie, etc., Jane the Virgin. And I haven't done this in five months, so if I mess a little bit or mumble a little bit, forgive me. Okay, guys? And, yes, thumbs up if you've been a Vampire Diaries fan almost these seven amazing years. I know that some of you are really disappointed that our Nina DeBro and Michael Trevino left the show, but they will always be our Tyler Lockwood and Elena Gilbert. And so this is season seven, it's episode one, guys. Um, it's day one of twenty two thousand give or take. Hmm. So left off from the last season, Lily's creepy old century heretics had came back to the land of the living. And you guys may be wondering why the ending scene like Matt Donovan like driving in the sheriff's car and you see Mystic Falls all damaged and you see Damon standing on top of the clock tower. Who knows? Maybe that's the future is gonna, gonna happen very soon. And lefting off, like, you know, Stefan and like Stefan and Caroline are stuck in a friend zone on the wall. For the last um, season, Stefan told Caroline that he will wait as long as he can, no matter how long is it, and Stefan won't stop waiting for Caroline to show true feelings to each other. I know you guys like like Caroline and every, everything else, and in this, ep in this first season, you clearly met Lily's heretics, Bo, the Mute, Mary, whatever, Nora, Valerie, and Malcolm. And they're really awkward, kind of, like when Valerie got hit by a car and it was a texting, like, hello, don't walk and text, Valerie, hello. And it was kind of really awkward. They're pretty strong as old century heretics. When Caroline and Matt try to blow up the house with them in it, but for some reason, they survived the bomb. And of course, never mess with a heretic, or else they're gonna take revenge on you. And um, they nearly killed Stefan and Caroline, but Lily stopped it because she doesn't want to start the bloodshed. And around the Mystic Falls, and she wants all the family to reunite, all that stuff. You know, Lily is up to her, so weird. And... It was kind of really sad when Damon kept drinking and like depressed of Elena gone. And it was kind of really sad when Damon told Bonnie that every time when I see you, it's not Elena. And that's kind of depressing. And Alaric is being not himself ever since Kai stabbed Joe to death. Sorry, Joe. R.I.P. And, um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. All the heretics, all that stuff. And I wonder what was the ending scene about when three years later, when Damon's still waiting for Elena to wake up, but someone's aiming vampire. Someone's aiming Stefan and Damon. Who could it be? We'll find out. And uh, I know this is really random, I haven't done this in a while, but I hope you enjoy this review. And just in case you guys miss watching this episode, it's down below, hurry up and watch it. Um, soon more episodes come in, this episode link will disappear, so watch it really soon. Follow on my social media network, add me on Snapchat. I'll see you guys in the next video. More thing. <laughs> I was kidding this. What was your guys' reaction when Damon killed Malcolm? Lily's heretic teacher's pet. Comment below. <laughs> Bye guys.